good day to one and all this is another episode on dentistry and more where we will be talking about how do you take an orthopentomogram or an panoramic radiography first and foremost we start off with the detailed entry of the patient details for the identification purpose wherein we add in the personal id of the patient as well as their name details followed by the date of birth and then the gender after entering each of these details we move forward before the radiation exposure wherein we save the details and then we click the icon go to 2d imaging before we press the icon for panoramic exposure we have to position the patient we ask the patient to stand upright with their feet together and then ask the patient to bite that is their maxillary and the mandibular incisor should bite within the indentation that can be seen on the bite block ask the patient to touch their tongue on the roof of the palate adjust the head as well as we try to uh, adjust the height of the machine in accordance with the patient we ask the patient to rest their chin onto the chin rest three lines that's a red lines that you can see that is a laser pointer lines we have three planes to this that is the one is the frankfurt horizontal plane which has to be parallel to that of the flow and the other is the sagittal plane which has to coincide with the midline of the patient's face and the third line is supposed to be coinciding with the lip commissure area to that of the ala of the nose and then we are trying to adjust on the screen of the opg machine wherein we try to uh, fit into the patient's parameters as exposure parameters which is required based on the patient's body build and then you can see here there is a 66 kvp as well as an 8 ma of exposure that has been assigned for the patient and then we uh, press the play button so that we are ready for exposure and you can see here outside on the screen itself we have already pressed the panoramic exposure button and then it's been exposed and this is how we get the panoramic imaging as you can see once the patient is been exposed you can see the gantry is trying to rotate the sensor as well as the image receptor in 180 degrees rotation around the patient and this is how the final image looks like of that patient this is how you get a panoramic radiograph been taken and after that you can adjust accordingly on the screen itself the brightness as well as the contrast for the patient's image next is how we are going to take a print of this radiographic image onto our digital printer this is an another patient's case wherein i am taking a print out for the radiographic image wherein i click onto the icon of a dicom print and then i select the layout that is i need a layout for the opg and then i enter the details in regarding to the age as well as the gender already the patient's name details has been seen on the screen itself within the print layout that i require and then i give the command for the printing to be done by pressing the okay button and then forward you can see that how the printing is been done within the digital printing machine itself and this is how you can see the number so you can see the pro that is that icon saying that it is being processed or is being getting printed out and this is how the digital image has been printed out so you can see from the slot itself the digital print out is come out from the slot and you can see the image that has been taken out of the print now you can see the printed copy of the image that has been taken and this is how it looks like thank you for listening good day